and materializes beneath your feet. Your weight falls back into your body all at once, and bright sunlight suddenly illuminates your surroundings. As you look around, you realize you're still aboard the Lady Vengeance. A gust of fresh sea air caresses you, and warm sunshine coaxes the bones of your skull and hands to tighten pleasantly. <coughs> oh, one moment, please. <coughs> oh, just a moment. Malady explodes in a fit of retching that racks her body. At last, she sneezes and expels a glob of something shiny and silver onto the deck. It wriggles quickly off the siding and plummets into the sea with a splash. Ah, better. Let's not do that again any time soon. Hmm? Oh, don't start. It was all I could do to save a few of them. It's no mean feat bringing an entire ship full of unspent souls to the Hall of Echoes, you know. I managed all the interesting ones, though. You're welcome. I do hope you learned something useful on our little field trip. Even I know when to pay attention to the gods. Tell me what you saw. I see. So, your god seemed uncharacteristically frightened, told you the void was coming, and that only you could ascend to divinity, after which you felt a cold deep within you. Well then, it sounds like you need to ascend, doesn't it? And quickly. She inspects her fingernails with great attention, then looks up at you from under an arched eyebrow. Did they mention how you were meant to become the next divine? Oh, what confidence you inspire. Luckily for you, Mama Malady is here to help. We already know you can bless, but as far as I know, you can neither see source nor take it as you see fit. I may not know much about divinity, but I do know that any god woken worth their salt will know how to perform all these oh-so-fantastic feats. You need to go see the Meister. Oh, she's got one of those things in Driftwood, you know, the building where people go and they do things inside of it. Uh, home, that's it. She's got a home in Driftwood. Give me your map. There you are. Tell her I sent you and she'll handle the rest. You're at the beginning of a long journey, Godwoken. Long, but exceedingly interesting. Now, I must be going, and so must you. Shopping. Why, our faithful little sloop, of course. We can all ride together. Won't that be terribly fun? Before you go, if I'm not back by the time you find out where our journey takes us next, you can call me back here. Tell the ship. She'll know how to summon me. And in the unlikely case you don't manage to do whatever it is you'll need to do to become what you need to become, you could call me. But I would be grateful if it doesn't come to that. <laughs>